All right, so in Windows 8 Consumer Preview, I decided to go ahead and launch PowerShell since I'm using that a lot now, especially at work, and I'm um, just trying to continue to learn it. Um, I wanted to see what version it was, so you do dollar sign host, and you can find out right here the version is 3.0. I think you could install 3.0 as well on Windows 7 if you so desire. Uh, supposedly they added a lot of stuff and components from uh, Visual Studio. So, you know, like here's, it's pretty cool to go ahead and just run, you know, check, get your processes or, or whatever you want to do, get service. Um, but if you wanted to start writing scripts, which is what I, I'm kind of doing at work, uh, I like to use ISC. Now ISC looks different. So this is a new version here, and it's pretty cool because they, they actually have a list of commands down here on the side. So under different modules, so, you know, depending on what module you want to, you want to use or just leave it at all you can they, they added this IntelliSense as well so if I went if I wanted to you know I want to see all the processes listed and I can't remember exactly what it is if I do get process I can scroll through and go oh print, print job there's all kinds of cool stuff in here get print driver it should show all the print drivers on the machine um, get process now get your processes I noticed by default the views a little bit different they just have the console view here, and um, let's see if you go to view, show script pane. So here's where you can, you know, do some cool stuff with uh, um, writing scripts, and and you know, if you want to set scheduled tasks and everything, you write a script here, and you know, you can do your multi-line stuff, um, and blah blah blah. So and just save it. But um, I do like this. I, I'm kind of interested in playing around with this. But I wanted to do a quick video just to show you, you know, what else is different with Windows 8 Consumer Preview. And I think they have like a couple of other command line switches. So if you want to launch this with, you know, a different profile or no profile, um, also like some sort of multi-threaded apartment mode and um, some other cool things. But I'm really interested in, in doing a lot more scripting now because of the IntelliSense. And um, hopefully it'll help me learn and everything. Do you guys use PowerShell? How about anybody out there? You guys use PowerShell? Um, I find it very helpful and I, 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 I find that I can pretty much do anything I need to do in PowerShell. 